Now, the old Swan Mary and the Bookworm Cowboy here. And the book today is League of Extraordinary Gentlemen, Volume 1 by Alan Moore and Kevin O'Neill. The comic book is set in the world where fictional characters interact with each other. It's like the biggest crossover ever. But this book focuses on Mina Murray from Dracula and she, she, she's putting up a team where they fight against the enemies of England. She recruits Captain Nemo off of 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea who in this one is like in the original book was from India an Indian guy and she also recruits Alan Quartermain from the book series who in this one at, at the beginning is an opium addict but quits later on and also she also recruits Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde and Holly Griffin the Invisible Man they have to save England from a war gang war between Fu Manchu, who, who in this one is called the Devil Doctor, and, and against Professor Moriarty, Sherlock Holmes' nemesis, and the boss of the league. I like Alan Moore's work. Too bad he gets whiny every time his stuff goes into theaters or television series. I just wish that Alan Moore would get involved with Hollywood to make them stay true to the, his vision of the characters and such. Every author, every other author does it. Why can't he? I mean, he refuses to watch the movies based on his work. He even refuses money from Hollywood. <clears throat> I mean, he refuses money made from the movies he, uh, that they made of his works. But I don't know. I guess it gets tiring being betrayed. This comic book is awesome. Look up The League of Extraordinary Gentlemen, Volume 1. And I'll catch you all later. Bye-bye. By the way, Happy Independence Day.